Alright, hello everybody, my name is Pixelmas35, and welcome to week two of the audiobook readings for February. This, uh, today we will be reading Dr. Seuss's One Fish, Two Fish, Red Fish, Blue Fish. Um, same thing with Cam the Hat, I haven't opened the book yet, I just saw the cover, got it, and now I'm gonna start reading. So, yeah, let's hope this video is not 11 minutes long. Let me just check how many pages are there. Less than... 50 there is about 62. All right, so this is going to be 11 minutes long. Let's go. One fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish. And then, yeah, it's, it's repeated from there. Ooh, from the very beginning of the book, little hidden thing. From there to here, from here to there, funny things are everywhere. Let me, let me fix up the mic. There you go. One fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish. Black fish, blue fish, old fish, new fish. This one has a little star. This one has a little car. Say, what a lot of fish there are. Yes, some are red and some are blue. Some are old and some are new. Some are sad and some are glad. And some are very, very bad. Why are they so... Why are they sad and glad and bad? I do not know. Go ask your dad. Oh, the background noise of the computer. Starting up again. Some are thin and some are fat. The fat one has a yellow hat. From here to there, from there, from from there to here, from here to there, funny things are everywhere. Here are some who like to run. They run for fun in the hot, hot sun. Oh me, oh my, oh me, oh my, what a lot of fun things go by. Some have two feet and some have four. Some have six feet and some have more. Where do they come from? I cannot say, but I bet they have come a long, long way. Well, these illustrations, they're pretty neat. If you haven't read a Dr. Seuss book ever, Go pick up a book and read one, because the audio is just a half of the thing. We see them come, we see them go. Some are fast and some are slow. Some are high and some are low. Not one of them is like another. Don't ask why, go ask your mother. Don't ask us why, go ask your mother. Say, look at his fingers. One, two, three. How many fingers do I see? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. He has eleven! Eleven! This is something new! I wish I had eleven, too. Alright. Bump! 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 Did you ever ride a wump? We have a wump with just one hump. But I know a man called Mr. Gump. Mr. Gump has seven hump wump. So, if you like to go bump bump, just jump on the hump of a wump of a gump. Ooh. Rap got over here. Who am I? My name is Ned. I do not like my little bed. This is no good. This is not right. My feet stick out of bed all night. And when I pull them in, and when I pull them in, oh dear, my head sticks out of bed up here. We like our bike. It's made for three. Our Mike sits on the back, you see. We like our Mike, and this is why. Mike does all the work when hills get high. When the hills get high. Oh, look, it's Ned. Hello there, Ned. How do you do? Tell me, tell me, what is, what is new? How are things in your little bed? What is new? Please tell me, Ned. I do not like this bed at all. A lot of things have come to call. A cow, a dog, a cat, a mouse. Oh, what a bed! Oh, what a house! Getting a lot of... A lot of, uh, nostalgia from this. It's an old look for me. Oh, dear, oh, dear, I cannot hear. Will you please come over near? Will you please look in my ear? There must be something, I fear. Something in there, I fear. I think I read that right. Say, look, a bird was in your ear, but he is out, so have no fear. Again, your ear can hear, my dear. But ear. Oh, oh this, this next page is pretty neat. My hat is old, my teeth are gold. I have a bird I like to hold. My shoe is off, my foot is cold. My shoe is off, my foot is cold. I have a bird I like to hold. My hat is old, my teeth are gold. And now my story is all told. Yeah. We took a look. We saw a nook. On his head, he had a hook. On his hook, he had a book. On his book was how to cook. We saw him sit and try to cook. He took a look at the book in the at the book on the hook. But a nook can't read, so a nook can't cook. So what what good to a nook is a hook cookbook? Ooh, feels good. The moon was out and we saw some sheep. We saw some sheep take a walk in their sleep. By the light of the moon, by the light of the star, they walked all night from near to far. I would never walk, I would take a car. Oh boy, I do not like this one so well. All he does is yell, yell, yell. 
I would not have this one about. When he comes, I put him out. This one is quiet as a mouse. I like to have him in the house because he's quiet. Unlike me! At our house, we open cans. We have open many cans. We have to open many cans. And this is why we have a Zans. A Zans for cans is very good. Have you a Zans for cans? You should. This guy. I like to box. I, how I like, I like to box. How I like to box. So every, oh, I like to box. How I like to box, like that. So every day I box a gox. In yellow socks, I box my gox. I box in yellow gox box socks. Yeah. There we go. It is fun to sing if you sing with a ying. My ying can sing like anything. I sing high and my ying sings low. And we are not too bad, you know. Ooh, this one. This one, I think, is called a yink. He likes to wink. He likes to drink. He likes to drink and drink and drink. The thing he likes to drink is ink. The ink he likes to drink is pink. He likes to wink and drink pink. So, if you have a lot of ink, you should go. You should get a yink, I think. Hop, hop, hop. I am a yap. All I like to do is hop from finger top to finger top. I hop from left to right and then, hop up, I hop right back again. I like to hop all day and night from right to left and left to right. Why do I like to hop, hop, hop? I don't know. Go ask your pop. Ooh. Nostalgia 100 for this next page. Brush, 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 brush. Comb, 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 comb. Blue hair is fun to brush and comb. All girls who like to brush and comb should have a pet like this at home. Aha. It is me. Who is this pet? Say, he's wet. You never yet met a pet, I bet, as wet as they let this wet pet get. Ooh, feels good, man. Whoa. Did you ever fly a kite in bed? Did you ever walk with ten cats on your head? Did you ever milk this kind of cow? Well, we can do it. We know how. If you never did, you should. These things are fun, and fun is good. Hello, hello, are you there? Hello, I called you up to say hello. I say hello. Can you hear me, Joe? Oh, no, I cannot hear your call. I cannot hear your call at all. This is no good, and I know why. The mouse has cut the wire. Goodbye. From near to far, from here to there, funny things are everywhere. These yellow pets are called Z are called the Zeds. They have one hair on their heads. Their hair grows fast, so fast, they say. They need a haircut every day. Who am I? My name is Ish. On my hands I have a dish. I have this dish to help me wish. When I wish to make a wish, I have I wave my hand with a big swish swish. Then I say, I wish for fish. And I get fish right on my dish. Swish. So, if you wish to wish a wish, you may swish for fish with my Ish wish dish. Waha! At our house, we play, we play out back. We play a game called Ring the Gack. Would you like to play this game? Come down. We only have we have the only gack in town. Like a fancy reindeer. Whoa. Look what we found. In the park in the dark. We will take him home. We will call him Clark. He will live at our house. He will grow and grow. Will our mother like this? We don't know. I wonder if these are the same kids from Cat in the Hat. I and mean, they're wearing different colors. These two have yellow. And I don't think the other kids have yellow. So like it's cinematic universe. And now, good night. It is time to sleep. So we sleep with our pet Zeke. This computer is loud. That's gonna get annoying. If I cover it like this. Oh, dang it, I closed the book. Oh no. Jack, Clark, there you go. Tomorrow is gone. Today was fun. Tomorrow is another one. Every day from here to there, funny things are everywhere. Oh, I just finished. Oh. Well. And that was Dr. Seuss. One fish, two fish, three fish, three fish. Uh, did you guys know? A little fun. Whoa. There you go. Did you know? Little fun fact with uh, Dr. Seuss books. Horton hears a no. Horton hatches an egg. Horton hears a who. And how the Grinch stole Christmas are all actually part of the same series of books. In the first book, Horton has terrible friends, and that's all we know. In the second book, um, Horton hears a who. Which is tiny, like, people living on a dandelion. And Horton protects them from his terrible friends. 
and he tells the Who's, hey, you better be loud or else, you know, you'll you'll die. Well, because someone will uh, kill you and stuff. They'll accidentally step on you. And in the How the Grinch Stole Christmas, the civilization of people down there, the Who's in Whoville, continuously make noise, noise, and noise, and noise, so they can be heard from the outside world. But since the story is from the per perspective of the Grinch, he just tries to stop them from making noise. But they keep doing it anyways. Uh, one, because, you know, Christmas spirit and stuff, it's, you know, it's, it's a cool thing. And for two, so they won't die. So, Grinch could have been, like, the biggest terrorist ending an entire world. And, and that's pretty dangerous? Yeah. All right. Cool beans. I'll see you folks later. <laughs>